On defense, John Michael Lyles is paired with Mikhail Jordan. Sit back and enjoy this one. Carolina outfitted in their third sweaters for this afternoon's play. Here's Eric Stahl moving up quickly for a shot denied by Richard Bachman out of the corner. He has five assists in his last four games. It comes in on Jordan Stahl. He's flushed out by Andrew Ferentz, the Edmonton captain. A handoff, Nestrashill this way, Hainsey. His shot fought off by Bachman. Loose out in front. Reversal over the line. Walks in on Ward. And he's thwarted on the way through by Ryan Murphy. Back to the point. Ryan Nugent Hopkins, rather, Matt Hendricks goes to work. Hendricks along the boards now for Teddy Purcell. Purcell in tight, a good shift. It's a late man right off the goal post on a line change. The Toronto franchise. This is his 26th National Hockey League game. It squirts out to center ice. Jordan Stahl for the Hurricanes along the boards. Now Nathan Gerby. One-timer taken by Nestrashill is caught by Richard Buckman. Job on defense by Mikhail Jordan. Edmonton had one shot with an unsuccessful power play. It's carried here by Teddy Purcell. He's right in. He'll turn to the outside. Oosterly shot. Put off by Cam Ward. Rebound off the goalpost by Neil Yakupov. Deal, though, by Carolina's Ryan Murphy. Rissanen will chug out to center. Rasmus Rissanen, his pass cut off by Jordan Everly. Nugent Hopkins over the line. Bears in. His shot. He scores! Ryan Nugent Hopkins. 1-0. Edmonton. Well, the old turnover in the neutral zone. I want you to watch Jordan Eberle. What a play he makes, and then the wise indirect pass. Stick on the ice, indirects it off the boards. Nugent Hopkins, decoys enough. Road. Justin Falk now ahead of Teddy Purcell. Here's Elias Lindholm. Good defense by Oscar Clefbaum. Back out to center ice. Here's Purcell. His shot stopped by Ward, and the rebound controlled. Ryan Murphy in control. Wristing one off a of body. A good block by Boyd Gordon. The Oilers attempt to get it out. Murphy in control this way. It's Eric Stahl. His shot fended off by Bachman, and it goes out of play, said the coach. But it'll be interesting to see where that goes, and will Elias Lindholm play a little center in the 18 games that remain after this one out in front? Cam Ward says no, a dandy right there. It was opposed by Boyd Gordon on the faceoff, accepted here by Justin Falk. Right on the tape of Jordan Stahl. A lead pass, Kirby's in, Nathan Kirby walks in for a shot denied, and Bachman holds on. Getting to it, Elias Lindholm inside for Eric Stahl, Victor Rask out in front, now Lindholm by him, picked off by Teddy Purcell, and away go the Oilers. A lead pass for Derek Roy, Roy's in, body down and covered up by Cam Ward. Sway, Justin Schultz, Teddy Purcell there too, it's loose, Justin Folk for the Hurricanes, tries to move it off the stick of Dwyer, and away he goes. Short-handed. Patrick Dwyer walks in denied by Richard Bachman. To the outside for Schultz. Everly. Schultz play catch. Around the clock it goes. In control. A tip out in front. Everly scores. Jordan Everly had an easy mark. And he makes it 2 nothing Edmonton. Big afternoon for Everly. I think we have to go back and look at this penalty because I, I think it's a reputation call. I don't see anything there that really Semin deserved the hook. I, his work ethic and, and legs moving could have been more assertive, but... Carolina has the quartet of killers on the ice. Jay McClement, Patrick Dwyer, Justin Falk, along with Ron Hainsey. They pop in. Out in front, off the goalpost. Purcell off of Cam Ward as Everly. What, two or three posts? Mm -hmm. Everly has had a heck of a day. Two points already. Wrapped in now by Teddy Purcell. Top of your screen, Rasmus Rissanen. Jordan Everly right out in front. They score! A doorstep bang in by Ryan Nugent Hopkins. His second goal this afternoon. 3-0 Edmonton. Much too easy of a pass to the front of the net. You know, the Carolinas, they seem to do an all kills, forces to dump it, and Everly does it again. Just swipe. Semin with a shot looking for a tip, none available. The tip attempt that time by Riley Nash. Nash, Semin's in. He'll delay, rolls in on Bachman. Semin taken down, they score on the follow up. Good work by Alexander Semin. And the Hurricanes get a fortuitous bounce and get on the scoreboard.
Well, you hope this is a leadership moment for Semin. There he is, right side of your screen. Takes a penalty. Earlier in this period, leads to a power play goal. And then drives the front of the net. Riley Nash just got beat to the front of the net on the most recent Edmonton goal. Gets it to Semin, and then what a play with his stick and the delayed penalty. Center ice, Jordan is in. He'll move it along in back of Bachman, now played here by Clefbaum. Battle ensues in back of the Edmonton goal. Clefbaum is held up. Eric Stahl on and off the stick. Moved along. Chipped in. Elias Lindholm out in front. And Carolina is within one. Second period line change, just watch this area right here. Talk about the defenseman being a part. Defenseman goes off, on comes Hainsey. Stahl actually right in the hash marks is gonna be well defended, but here comes Ron Hainsey. Rask again, Volk awaiting. Inside Lindholm between the wickets of Skinner now. Rask again, Justin Falk. Inside for Lindholm, he'll dart to the slot. Skinner scores! That's hockey, baby! You had to wait, and so did he. Skinner resting the puck, getting it straight. Carolina will stay in the power play, and they've tied it. This whole thing is about Elias Lindholm. He's going to try to fight after winning the faceoff with help from his wingers. Tries to find Skinner first. Skinner just misses. As the Oilers attempt to break out, and Carolina, as we see, takes over. Ryan Murphy, 15 seconds on the clock. Now Gerby's in the zone. Jordan Stahl thinks about it. Here's Murphy. He'll delay. Shot taken. Turned out by Bachman. The rebound. It's nowhere near a guarantee. And then it ranges all the way down to, what, just under 10%. So I think that diminishes uh, the incentive to, to lose games, quite frankly. John Forslund, Trip Tracy, Chantel McKay. Michelle off a stick wide off Teddy Purcell. Who had the stick ripped out of his hands. It's loose along the boards. Nestrashill, Lindholm dancing. Nestrashill again, his shot. He scores! Andre Nestrashill, another power play goal. Carolina has climbed the mountain. Purcell had blocked a shot and now he's going to lean on his stick and recognizes it's broken. And now he comes up here to go to the bench, and the Hurricanes knew it. And that helps to create... Back again for Lyles, a quick up in direct fashion, was off the stick of McClement, in on Bachman. The Oils, the Oilers come back. It comes back out to center ice. Lyles is there, he'll slam it ahead, look out! He almost caught Richard Bachman. He's defended by Mark Fain, just about five minutes gone in this third period. To the point it goes for Justin Falk. Here it comes, denied by Richard Bachman. It stays in play. Nestrashill had it, lost it, settled down by Falk. Now moving in, a chance for Rast, denied by Bachman. Edmonton peeling back. Skinner diagonally across, skate the stick, Lyles. Murphy, a one-timer blocked by Gordon. Murphy gets it back, skate the stick, Skinner. His shot, he scores! That front presence of Nestor Schill on one unit, Jordan Stahl on the other. Watch the left side of your screen. Jeff Skinner, and watch how his positioning is just on the inner portion of these dots. Skinner both scored on the power play. Held in by Mikhail Jordan. Jordan, a handoff. Rask goes inside to Eric Stahl. Stahl for Rask. Rask again, a power move, a chance. They score! Elias Lindholm! That's hockey, baby! Carolina up by three! What an afternoon for Elias Lindholm. There he is, far side, strong side, has rush, gets out of the way now. A little looping pattern behind the net. Nugent Hopkins along with Jordan Eberle, who has the puck, each have three points today as it rolls all the way in. Justin Falk, a reverse for Ron Hainsey, a fancy pass, look out. A goal, 
A bad turnover right onto the stick of Ryan Nugent Hopkins. Edmonton down by two. Well, watch uh, Ron Hainsey, right side of your screen on the goal line. There are certain plays, you know, where you go to the middle on a breakout, but you don't do it unless you're absolutely sure. And this is the second tough interchange going to the middle from Hainsey to Jordan Stahl in his many third periods. Remember, he tried to do it. Yeah. Turns it over. Controlled here by Teddy Purcell all the way across. Tough one to handle for Martin Marincin, but he gets it inside. Now Yakupov, Teddy Purcell, he'll come calling off. Cam Ward who denies. Purcell for the Oilers now gets a pass from Derek Roy. Purcell hits a seam, good back check by Riley Nash. Jordan Osterley got to it. Yakupov off the pad of Cam Ward by Schultz. 90 seconds left. It pinballs into Teddy Purcell. Purcell in control. Side of the goal, Hendricks. Derek Roy had it, lost it, broken up by Eric Stahl. He sets up Lindholm. Bullseye, hat trick. Five points, Elias Lindholm, Carolina in control. How this play started completely shows how this game turned. Carolina, you could drive a semi through the front of the net in the first half. You see all the numbers, including Justin Falk here. So much better in that dimension than Eric Stahl. 